Uh, well, hello there, guys. It's the Ballot Prince, and welcome to um the Stanley Parable. A friend told me, hey, I can see fraps. That's so cool. A friend told me that oh, this game is pretty cool. He played the demo, and he said it's really fun, or something, something along that line. Honestly, I have no clue what this game is about. I just want to give it a shot, and hey, um, let's get into it, shall we? Begin the game. Never the end is never the end is never the end is loading. All right, so the end is never loading, or the never end is loading, or it's ending, it's loading, never ending. Like, I don't know, what is this game, what is this game even about? As far as I know, my, my name is Stanley, and I'm British, or English, or something like that. It would explain the accent. Yeah, anyway. Loading. So am I still loading? Do, 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 do. Wow, that loading time. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Stanley! Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on the keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day, of every month, of every year. And although others might have considered it soul ending, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. That's great! And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He met a girl. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened. This complete isolation. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and now. stepped out of his office. All right, so. I can't jump, can I? I can't jump. All right, 429, 428. Let me see my number. Let me see it, let me see it. 427. Here you go. All right, so... All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Aliens! Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. That's true. Four, hold on, 437. Oh, I'm 427, got it. Okay, the meeting room. He walks very slightly, goodness. Where are the meeting room? Hello, what's that? Somebody spilled coffee. He's bad. It's probably 416. All right, nobody's in there. What are you guys working on? Is that math? No, 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 not interested. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No, he didn't. <laughs> this okay. was not oh, gosh. the correct way to the meeting room, uh -oh. and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Yes, of course, duh. Psh, yeah, duh. Of course he wants to stick by the employee lounge. Ah, yes, truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Wow, Stanley coffee. simply stood here, drinking it all in. Uh-huh, he did indeed. Cold drinks, I see. What should I got for? Oh, you can, you can crouch. That's like a shovel. Yes, really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating, that even though all your co-workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Really worth it. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Or did he? <laughs> and so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. <laughs> sure he did. This voice actor is amazing, I must say that. He is cool. I like him. Reminds me of the guy in Castlevania. This is a lot more funny. 
But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. So now in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh, uh, from here it's, um, left. Left. There you go. Oh, no. What? No, it's to the right. My mistake. Oh, come on. What are you doing this? No. Thing? What? No, 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 not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? What come was on. I thinking? Open up. It's clearly... Oh, dear. Would you hold on for a minute, please? Sure. Oh. Well, let's see. We went down right, left, down, left, right. No. Uh. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. All right. Ooh, hello. Boing. Oh, I can't. Ooh, whoa, what no, the heck? No, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed whoa. to be here yet. This That's is all it. a spoiler. Quick, Stanley, close your eyes. Okay, 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 okay. We just, we just fired back to, um, oh, Where's who am I kidding? It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about, rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. And this time, suppose we don't wander so far off track, hmm? Sure. Okay. From the top. From the top. <laughs> I can tell. This game is going to be fun. All right. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? When Don sang. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply Maybe missed a memo. memo. Yes. This time I'll go to the room on the left. Even though I don't want to. When Stanley... Wait. Wait. What? What? No. I'm... No, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game over. Completely fresh. Everything should be... Huh? Four doors. Why did something change? Stanley, did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? No. Did you move the story somewhere or... A... No. Hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. What are you talking about, okay, man? then. It's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. Let's find the story! Alright. So let's go here first. Uh, inner guilt. Everyone knows... Okay, no, I thought, like... I didn't even read it. Who's out here? Is it the wolf among us? Hello? Wait, what? What, what, what? What, what? Okay, you know what? I'm staying left. I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. Do we just... Do we need to restart the game again? Yeah, I think well, so. I find it unlikely that what? we'll ever progress by starting over and over again. But it's got to be better than this. Okay, let's give it a shot. Why not? Are you serious? <laughs> this game, whoever made this game, I applaud All of you. All his co-workers were gone. I applaud what you. What could it mean? You're a genius. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. You're a genius. This is fun. This is a lot of fun. Are you serious? Okay, yeah, it's worse. I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. This Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything? Are you kidding me? Math. 416. Coffee. What, what did I mean? 256. Aha! I knew we'd miss something. The story. Here it comes. Wait, what the heck? No, wait, never mind. Not the story. Okay, let's head back the other way and retrace our steps. Mr. Man Person. This is getting a nut. What? What kind of game is this? Now this... Well, I'll be honest. I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. It... Is that correct? Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? Yeah. But well, you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed restart. to be doing, how about this? You win! Yay! Congratulations! I know you put in a lot of hard work, and it really paid off, so good job. Yeah, I did it. Oh, no. No, I don't what? feel right about this at all. We both know you didn't put in any actual work for that win. I still won. Some people win fair and square, 
And this was not one of those situations. Blech. Okay, I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what might happen this time, I have to restart. Fine. Bloody hell, the end is never is the end loading. Goodness, this, this game is fun, but what? All it's right, I've got a solution. That. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Just follow the line. How simple is that? Just follow the line, TM. <laughs> you see? The line knows where the story is. It's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. Though, here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or to put it another way, is the story of no destination still a story? What's over Simply here? by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Yeah, you go ahead. Now, we can both agree that the nature of existence is, in fact, a byproduct of one subjective experience of that existence, right? What okay. the heck? Is this now, if my experience edge? of your existence rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, is this office, in fact, the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. Wow. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. Indeed. Well, I'd like to apologize. Not sure where I was going with all that. You know what? I think what Number we need six. right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Yeah, man. <laughs> Cut the music. Hey, go back and look at that fern. Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. Sexy. All right, let's go. <laughs> yeah.